Hi Beauty Smarties, it's Maria back again, and today we are gonna be testing out three viral hair hacks. These hacks claim to give you the perfect curls in just a few seconds, but we'll see how true that actually is. And did you catch the last episode of Beauty Smarties? If you haven't, it might be because you aren't already subscribed, so press that red subscribe button down below so you don't miss out on our next one. And let's get right into this video. You've probably seen this hack all over your timeline. I know I've seen it on mine. We are going to test out the pencil curl. For this hack, all you'll need is some heat protectant, a regular wooden pencil, and a flat iron. The first step to this hack is to grab a very small section of hair and twist it around the pencil until the entire length is wrapped around. This will help give your hair its shape. To start molding the hair into place, we will need some heat. For this, I'm gonna take a flat iron and smooth it over the hair a couple times. And finally, you can just release the curl. Shirley Temple who? So this is how the curls came out. They're super tight, natural looking curls. So I did use a regular wooden pencil. I think they would probably come out even better if you used a pencil with a rounded barrel, probably like a colored pencil or something. Just make sure that it's not plastic. This took me about 15 minutes to do, so it is a really quick hairstyle. Depending on the thickness and the amount of hair you have, you could probably do this in about 30 minutes. So I think that is a win in my book. The second hack we're going to try out is curling your hair in a ponytail to save some time. This is supposed to create a nice, loose, beachy curl. For this hack, all you need is a brush, a hair tie, a curling wand, and some hairspray. First, with your hair loose, go ahead and brush through all the knots in your hair. This will make styling the hair a little easier. Next, gather your hair into a high ponytail and start curling the hair section by section. Once the entire ponytail is curled, you're supposed to let your hair go and end up with the perfect curly hair in half the time. All right, so the hair is all curled in the ponytail. Now, the real truth comes out when we pull this ponytail out. So, here goes. Let's see what it looks like, guys. I feel like as I'm doing this, I'm like stretching out the curls, and that does not feel good. Oh gosh, guys. I don't know what all this is going on over here. All right, guys, as you can see, this hack might need a little bit of assistance. The curls are really nice down here, but I don't know what is going on over here. So it leads me to believe that if you have semi-curly or wavy hair like I do, it might need a little bit more work. So this hack, I'm still on the fence about. So I'm just gonna make my part and smooth down these flyaways. 
see like to fix it, I kind of have to brush through the curls, which like defeats the purpose of the hack, I guess. Okay guys, I think this is as good as it's gonna get with this hack. It didn't do too much to this part over here. This might not be a good hairstyle to do if you're like going to a special occasion, but if you're like running late for school, I guess you can get away with it. I'm gonna have to trash this hack. The third and last hack we're gonna try involves a headband hair twist for loose curls. For this hack, we will need a headband, some hair mousse, and a blow dryer. The first step in this hack is to place a thick headband over your hair without pulling the hair all the way through as you would normally do. To give the hair a little bit more flexibility, just add some hair mousse. The hack here is to grab small sections of hair and start wrapping them around the headband. This motion is supposed to help set the hair into a curl shape. Repeat the step until your entire hair is wrapped into the headband. Since I know this would work better overnight, I'm gonna speed up the process by using a hair dryer for a few minutes. The heat from the blow dryer is gonna help mold and hold the shape of your hair. Now, all you have to do is remove the headband and see if it really did work. My curls were on so tight that it was a little hard to remove the headband, but we made it work. Well, this is how it came out, you guys. I was honestly expecting a better turnout. This side came out looking so much better than this side. This side looks like it tried to be a curl, but it's still not completely there. And then this side is a little fuller. So in my opinion, the thicker the hair you pull through the headband, the fluffier the curl will be, the smaller. You get the idea. I'm not too sure about this hack, but it could be because this headband is different thickness all the way around. So this part is a little thinner and this part is a little thicker. So I think that's why some of the curls look the way they do. Like we have some parts that look, I'm not even gonna talk about this, and some that look a little fluffier. So if you get a headband that is a little thicker all the way around, I think this could possibly work. Also, another tip is to take thicker sections of hair. It seems to work a little better. Like look at this curl right here. It's just living its life being a curl. So the thicker the hair you grab, the better. This one is just and there you have it, beauty smarties. We have a win, a fail, and a eh. I'd love to test some more hacks out, so let me know what other hacks you'd like to see tested next in the comment section down below. Also, do not forget to subscribe to Seventeen's YouTube channel. We go live with beauty smarties every Tuesday, and I'd like to have you back for next week. So don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you beauty smarties on the next one. Bye.